Elkhorn Ridge Golf Course, Back 9, Earthwork Construction, Zanstra Construction Incorporated. Master Craftsman, Superintendent, Ron Hutmaker. Craftsman, Robert Salmon. This project was for the Elkhorn Ridge Golf Course in Spearfish. We added nine holes to the original course winding through the original Frawley Ranch homestead. The 13 green sits next to the original cabin. One of the main goals was to impact as little of the natural landscape as possible. It consisted of moving 150,000 cubic yards of dirt and rock. The material varied from solid limestone on holes 10 and 11 to digging below the water table in the irrigation pond. The terrain varied from flat pasture land to rock cliffs with elevation changes of 100 feet from tee box to greens. These conditions required the use of many different machines, excavators and all-terrain trucks in the mud and rock to scrapers and dozers to shape and finish the greens and fairways. The project started in September with the removal of trees and brush defining the limits of each hole. Digging the irrigation pond was next. Most of this dirt was hauled across the state highway that required a two foot pad of dirt to be placed on the highway to protect the asphalt. This crossing was removed every night, replaced the next morning for 10 days. Moving to holes 10 and 11 required digging in solid limestone to get the fair waste and tee boxes to final grade. Holes 12, 13, and 14 had big elevation changes while winding through trees along the creek and the valley below, blending the greens into rock walls or bends in the creek. It took some design changes to get from the 15 tee box through hole 16 to the 17 green. The steep limestone hillside needed 20 foot of fill on top to get to the 16 tee boxes, and then turned and came right back down the hill to the 17 green, making for 100 foot elevation changes on these holes. The shaping of the greens, bunkers, and sand traps was a good place for a GPS system, as well as the imagination of the operators. Design changed on every hole. One of the unique design features of the entire course was the shaping of the bunkers to resemble tracks of local wildlife, including a lion's paw and the 17 green. The designers, Pat West and Chris Worley of West Associates, 